How can imagery improve sporting performance? Imagery for athletes is the act of creating or recreating a scenario in one's mind. Athletes may imagine not only the setting in which they would compete, but also the movements they perform. So, how can imagining something lead to improvements in sport? Well, research has found imagery to improve multiple variables which are associated with success in athletic performance, such as confidence, motivation, coping with injury and pain, regulating arousal, reducing competitive sport anxiety or stress, and increasing self-efficacy. For this presentation, I will be focusing on the positive correlation between improving self-efficacy and improved sport performance. Self-efficacy is the ability to organize and orchestrate all of one's skills in order to cope with any demands and circumstances they may face. The mechanism through which imagery improves self-efficacy is vicarious experience. This involves observing, or in this case imagining someone similar to themselves, successfully perform the required skill. It has been suggested that imagining oneself perform the skill can also provide self-efficacy gains through personal behavior history. The belief that one can competently reenact the skill as they have done it in the past, albeit in their mind. An example of the link between self-efficacy and physical performance can be seen in a 2007 study by Wells and colleagues. In this study, self-efficacy was measured before being assigned to one of three weightlifting groups. There was a light group who lifted less weight than they thought, a heavy group who lifted more than they thought, and a control group. The results found initial self-efficacy to be a significant predictor of baseline maximum strength, and manipulated self-efficacy was significant for performance change. This suggests that self-efficacy relates to both past performance experience and future performance. As researchers found imagery training can lead to increases in self-efficacy, and increases in self-efficacy are related with increased sport performance, Setting time aside to practice imagery training seems to be a worthwhile investment. A popular type of training is layered stimulus training. An individual begins with an easy to imagine stimulus and then will slowly add more stimulus and information to the setting until comfortable with all aspects of the visualization. A study has found participants who utilized layered stimulus training made significant improvements in comparison to groups which used other methods. The benefits of imagery aforementioned make imagery an instrumental tool for both athletes to practice and coaches to implement into training programs. For more information on imagery, visit the Wikiversity book chapter, Imagery in Sport, How Can Imagery Techniques Be Used to Improve Sporting Performance, which can be found in the description box below.